history. Again, you know, here we're talking, you know, you know we got a few hundred years to relate to. We're talking thousands here on both sides of, of history to say, you know, to say we have a history here. Both of them can do that, and then both can do it in, in, the, in the quadruple digits, you know. Uh, and then there is, of course, the religious component, which heats it up even all the more. So it just it just makes it a power kit in, in, in all ways. I have two different questions. One um, with Iran, do you think I mean is that their goal though to destroy? Oh yeah, I mean Iran Iran is is, is of the same mindset as uh, Hamas and Hezbollah. Uh, one state, a Palestinian state with not one Jew to be found in it. That sounds like Hitler. that you see. 
see there is essentially all the Palestinians have partial or full control of. Everything else that is solid green here, but white over here is Area C, which is 100% Israeli control. And notice, you know, no, it, I think it might be one thing if it was one large block of Palestinian territory. Look how it's so broken up. And that's because the, the Israels have been, the Israels are just squatting in, in, in their that, that's, territory. That's what, these they, settlements, that's what these settlements very largely are, yes. Well, I don't see how the UN lets them get away. Well, the there have been UN resolutions against, <laughs> but Israel kind of wants yeah, and, and like I said, I think, please, I think you know, please, please understand here, I'm not, what I'm trying to do is point out all the complaints. I'm, I'm really, don't go away again, like Father Shakur would say, don't go away thinking, oh, I'm on their side now, the rest of they can just, you know. Because like I said, the majority of folks on both sides are good people. I'm, I'm, I've been there enough, and I, I know enough of them to say that from experience. Um, but one of the things that happens, we've seen in our own news media, you say anything remotely negative towards uh, Israel or Israeli policy and what it get labeled with? Anti-Semitism. Being anti-Jewish. Now, is anti-Semitism, is anti-Judaism alive and well? Unfortunately, yes, very much so in the world. However, I would very staunchly and firmly say that just because you are against something that Israel is doing does not make you anti-Semitic. Although that is a scapegoat card that gets played to shut down what is often very needed and called for criticism of some policies. Wherever, it doesn't matter, so long as, you're, as long as you're not here. They don't care where they go. They do not care where they go as long as it is not here. But they don't suggest that to go right here and have a soft Not among the most extreme. Hezbollah, Hamas, the uh, folks in the, the, again, the power, the, the folks with the power and influence in Iran, no. Go wherever you want to go, just, just not here. Too much of a, and, and, and again, when I say Muslim population, I don't want to paint Muslims with, with a bad brush because again, I know too many Muslims here and in Israel that are wonderful people, and quite frankly, I trust more than some Christians I know. Um, but too, too large of a population there even, with enough of a contingent that is also radical extremist enough to say, uh uh, not here either. Not a lot, I would say, <coughs> but some. There's, oh, now, as far as business and whatnot, oh, like every day, all the time. Uh, uh, Jews going into shops, etc., owned by Muslims and vice versa. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, I mean, walking up and down the same street and not fighting with each other. And, oh, yeah, every day, you know, yeah, miles and miles and miles and miles of streets all across the country. So how is the bombing? Is it like an everyday occurrence? There? Oh no, 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 no. Mm -hmm. So they're just picking and choosing when they like know that there's going to be a great, greater number of people. In a yeah, I mean I don't know any. I mean, what do you call a major event? I don't know anything major as of late. Why did they have some bombing? What's from the Gaza? Yeah, we're very well now. As far as a rocket getting shot at Gaza, that's yeah, not, not as regular as the face of the moon. Which again is why Israel says, and you want us to do that with the West Bank? Uh-uh. But I can, I can understand them not wanting to pull out, you know, or not drop their guard with that effect, but they should not be 
making settlements into Palestinian <clears throat> territory. They're the ones crossing over yeah. and, and, and taking, the, taking the land back that they agreed to give them. Yeah, yeah. So here's the, the ones, uh, they're breaking their agreement, you know, not... All those blue dots are Israeli settlements in the West Bank. See, that's, that's, they should make them pull out. Jerusalem mm -hmm. Jerusalem is right here, and Bethlehem's right here. Can't see the blue. And they are in the West Bank. They, they what? They are in the West Bank. I mean, what the, those places? Bethlehem is. Jerusalem technically is not because again, it was supposed to be an international city, not in either partition. Like although, a, like a Vatican city or something. Although Israel has, in small scale, much like it's done in large scale, Israel has worked very hard to populate certainly East Jerusalem. Uh,